And it is back to school week. Cameron Fontana is in Hilliard this morning. He is live at Brown Elementary and Cam, a lot of a lot of kids actually looking forward to going back to school, especially since you're cleaning up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right, Karen. You know, I wasn't one of those kids when I was a kid. I loved summer so much. I didn't want to go back to school, but we know the kids here at Brown Elementary are so excited to return next week. So today on Good Day Columbus, we're actually going to be getting the school ready, meeting the brand new principal this morning, and just making sure these kids have an awesome environment to welcome them back to school. So we're going to toss it back to you guys. We have a lot to clean, it looks like, so we'll see you soon. I don't even <laughs> oh, know how to do this. Oh, you're such a good guy, Cam. Well, it is back to school week right here on Good Day Columbus. And we're visiting schools all over central Ohio. You know, they're super busy getting ready for the kids. Cameron Fontana is live this morning at Brown Elementary in Hilliard with a look at how they're getting ready this morning. What are you doing, Cam? Are you helping out? That's right, Courtney. Well, you know what? We are very excited because we have a big announcement to make here at Brown Elementary. Mrs. White, Rebecca, drum roll, please. Your brand new principal for 2016 at Brown Elementary is Principal Kate Miller. Welcome. Thank you, Cameron. How are you doing? Oh, I'm very excited. I'm honored and humbled to truly be here. That so. is awesome. Yeah. So how long have you been in education? We want to get to know you, and why did you decide to become a principal? Okay. I've been in education for 12 years, yeah. and really, my whole philosophy is based on a quote, to reach a child's mind, you must first capture their heart. Oh, and I good. wholeheartedly believe that. We're all about capturing um, the hearts and minds of all of our students at Brown, and we are excited yeah. and have a passion for a growth mindset here. So what's in store for this new school year? What do you have ready for these kids at Brown Elementary? Oh, so much. It's going to be such an exciting and fabulous year. We um, are all about individualized education and empowering our students to be successful, instilling in them a growth mindset, wow. and um, just making sure that they are excited and ready for tomorrow. And not only are you empowering the students, but you're empowering staff like Mrs. White and Rebecca Absolutely. with these awesome t-shirts, because on the back is your motto, right? It is. Read it out loud and proud. Be kind, work hard, and have fun. There you go, guys. We're going to toss it back to you guys. Be kind, work I hard, have fun. I love that. Oh, that, brown. I know. Oh, that is so God. awesome. Before you can reach a child's mind, you must reach their heart. It is back to school week right here on Good Day Columbus, and we are visiting schools all around the area to see how they're preparing for when students come back for a new year. Cameron Fontana, he's live at Brown Elementary this morning. Hey, Cam, a lot of, a lot of parents are ready for the kids to go back. I, I know they are, Karen, and you know what? We're helping make that transition nice and smooth, actually surprising Mrs. Matice here by getting her classroom ready. And we have Chuck D'Andrea. Chuck, what are you doing over here? Oh, I'm just getting these iPads ready for the school year. We got some new ones in, just getting them in their cases and labeling them. And All right. Well, coming up next in the 8 o'clock hour, we're going to head to more of the school, and I think we're going to the Media Center Library next. So we'll see you Ooh. soon. We got a lot of desks to put together. I love the library, and I love how hard Cam is working. And it's back to school. School week here on GDC. That's right, and we are going around visiting different schools and seeing how they're getting ready to welcome the kids back. And this morning, Cameron Fontana is at Brown Elementary in Hilliard. Hey, Cam. Hey, guys. Well, now we're hanging out with Miss Kay Richardson here in the Media Center. Hi. How are you doing today? I'm wonderful. Thank you. How are you? Good. So I think this is the area that everyone associates with school. Well, this is the Media <laughs> Center, right? That is exactly right. And I'm so glad people associate that with school. It's the heart of the school. Right. And yeah. what are you doing to get ready? I know I'm putting some of your books back here, but you're... Kids are coming a week yeah. from tomorrow. How do you prepare for what, more than 500 students to come out here? Oh my gosh, we are getting all our brand new books ready. We're getting them shelf ready Ooh. for the show. So we're getting ready to process all of these and get them into the system. And, no, and I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take it back right now. Okay. Because I do remember, is it the Dewey Decibel? <laughs> Decimal. Decimal. <laughs> See, and that's why I'm not back in school. A decimal system. That's correct. Do you guys still use that? It's, a lot of libraries do. Yes, oh, absolutely. There it is right there. So this is T, so this needs to go in the T section. This is in your fiction chapter books. I survived right here. Oh, perfect. They are a favorite of all oh. kids, especially. You have goosebumps. We have goosebumps. Okay, now I'm taking it real back. And look at this. <laughs> Calling All Creeps. That was like one of my favorite I books in school. Yes, it I'm still is a very favorite. <laughs> so you go through here. What are the different things that kids can do? Because you have computers. You have different types of books. How are they learning at such a oh young age? Oh my gosh, we have so much learning going on with our iPads and our laptops, with technology, with our smart board. We have all the books for research. We have everything you can do in here. We have makerspace, a whole wow. section out in the hallway for STEM projects. Now so, I know all the staff here is ready. What yes. are you most excited about when oh. the kids come? 
seeing the kids' faces for the first time. I'm brand new to this building. So oh, I'm, congratulations! Yes, yes. yes. So I'm so excited to meet all my new students and families. Great. At Brown. Yeah. Well, we're going to toss it back to you guys. There are a lot of books on that that I'm going to help you put back, okay? That's so, fabulous. We'll see you guys soon, okay? Thank you. A section. C. Uh, A section. Put go. him to work. I'm going to say three words Dewey Decimal System. <laughs> <laughs> And it is back to school week right here on Good Day Columbus, and we are visiting schools all over central Ohio. And Cameron Fontana is checking out how Brown Elementary in Hilliard is getting ready for students. Oh Cam, what are you doing now? Where, wait, how'd you make it go? <laughs> hey guys, well, you know what? What? Alexi right here is showing me a trick. Show the camera. What happened to your thumb right there? Let me see. Tell them what's happening. Is it going away? Make it go away. Oh, amazing. He's Houdini. Bravo. You have Houdini in your class, Mrs. Smiley. <laughs> I couldn't be more proud. This is so cool because we have kids here early. Of course, school officially starts next Wednesday, but I want to introduce everybody. This is Walker, his twin brother, Will. You met Alexi. We have AJ, Marley, Princess Jasmine, and Max. Now, what are they doing today, Mrs. Smiley? So we're going to be reading... Um, Lots of books, we're gonna be writing, we're actually gonna be doing some math activities, so we're kinda of just getting a jump start on the school year for first grade. And what does it mean to you? You see so many fresh faces every year. I mean, what do you have in store for them this year? I just, I love to get to know each and every one of them and how different they all are and the personality. So every year is so different and they bring so much more joy. Right. Like, look, the magic tricks they're playing for I us know. today. <laughs> this is hilarious. Now, this is right here, this is Walker. How's it going, Walker? Good. Good, what do you wanna be when you get older? Um, a cop. You want to be a cop? What do you want to try, though? What's that competition that you want to do? Ninja Warrior. Ninja Warrior? Now, this is your twin, Will. Who's older? Me. By how long? Two minutes. Two minutes? So we got a two-minute older twin right here. We're going to toss it back to you guys. You guys ready to read? Sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Let's see. House hunting. Ooh. Here you guys go. They're so cute. so cute. I'll take one of each. <laughs> Just bring them back. Bring so them back cute. with you. Schools are busy. They're getting things ready for students. And Cameron Fontana, he is live in Hilliard right now at Brown Elementary, checking it all out. Hey, Cam. That's a web. What's that one right there? Hey, Sean, what's this? That's an octopus. That's right, Livia. So, Miss Ellis, what are they doing right now? Well, right now, we are getting ready to come back to school. So we are getting our reading and our math brains working hard today. Wow. And some of my friends are working on their letter sounds and beginning sounds. And some friends are working on reading, and some are working on writing right now. Nice. Now, Charles, I want to ask you, what letter is this? K. K? What's that? King. What's that? Kia. Key, yes. Would well, you know what that is? Kite. <gasps> High five. Great job. Now, right over here is Allie. How's it going, Allie? Now, what? you said Charles is your what? Friend. He's your friend. You told me he was your BFF. No. Your, but yeah, she said he was your. Are, is she your BFF? No. no. She said it was off camera. So for the record, I think he's her BFF. Now we're gonna move right over here. Alex, what are you about to do right now? I'm making a card for my mom. Oh my gosh. Would you like to say something to your mom right now if she's watching? Hello, mom. Do you love her? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Well, we have Jod over here, and we have Ohm. How's it going, Ohm? Good. Are you excited to go back to school? Nope. No. No. <laughs> you know what? At least you're honest here at school, but you know what? It's going to be awesome. Okay, give me a high five. Yes. Now we're going to move right over here because we want to get everybody. We have Marcy, Suzanne, and Muhammad. Marcy, real quick, what are you reading about? I'm reading about... Um, what is that? Chrysanthemum? Mm -hmm. Very nice. What about you, Suzanne? Colors. Colors. Muhammad? Dogs. Dogs? Do you like dogs? Do you have a dog? No, we're going to get a dog when school's over. You're going to get a dog when school's over? Well, it's about to begin, so you got a couple months left, right? Now, before school's over, do you know what kind of dog you're going to get? A baby one. A baby one. That's, that's a good start, guys. We're going to toss it back to you. Can I read with you? Is that okay? Okay, Suzanne. <gasps> oh, ice cream. Uh, I love ice cream. That's awesome. Friends for life right there. It is back to school week, as a matter of fact, and we are going around. We're checking out different schools around central Ohio. They're pretty busy getting ready for students to return. It's hard to believe that I it's know. already that time of the year, right? So Cameron Fontana this morning is out and about in Hilliard to see what's going on at Brown Elementary. Cam? Well, hey, guys. We're hanging out in the art room right now with a couple of the teachers, a little bit of a roundtable planning session for the new school year. Now, we have with us Tracy, 
Rachel, Jane, and our principal, Kate, right here. Now, I want to ask you guys, because you're planning, as the art teacher, Rachel, uh, what are you looking forward to this year? What new things do you have? I'm looking forward to our second phase of the art curriculum. Last year, we talked about feelings, identity, and culture. So we're going to be talking about society, environment, and fantasy, how art can explore the unknown. Nice. Now, Tracy, big event going on right now in the world that's kind of bleeding into your curriculum this year. Yes, I'm so excited to tie the different sports of the Summer Olympics into everything the kids are doing. They love trying things they've never tried before and learn something new. So the kids at Brown are going to have like the Summer Olympics all year. They will be trying crazy things. What? And we like use scooters instead of, you know, That's bicycles. Sweet. So they'll really enjoy it. Now, Jane, you're the music teacher here, and I'm very passionate about music. Why is it so important to instill that foundation at such a young age? Well, music's important for everyone, but it also can be integrated into every other subject. Oh. So I really try to um, get the children to understand that it's part of history and math and reading and science, and we have a bulletin board in our room, and the kids, you know, look at it, and they say, hey, today we're focusing on math and music, and just That's to so see cool. that it's integrated in all of our lives in so many ways, but it also is just important for its own sake. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Now, Principal Kate, next Wednesday, the big day. The big day. It looks like you got a good team here with you. Are you excited? I have a fabulous team. We are so excited to have all the students, and we are ready to empower and grow minds. And just remember to be kind. Oh, is it, wait, is that oh, on the back of the shirt? It is. Oh, spin around. Wait, 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 yes. Here we go. Be kind, kind work, work hard, hard, and, and have, have fun. fun. Thank you so much for letting us come to your school Thank today. Thank you for coming out. We're going to toss it back to you. Let's get back to planning, ladies. Okay. We got we got 365 days to think of. Or I guess <laughs> Just 365. <laughs> That's not too much.